Hi everyone, I am Kate Forsyth and I'm here to celebrate World Book Day with the wonderful online bookstore Booktopia. So they've asked me to share with you one of my all-time favourite books and this was a very hard choice for me because I have loved so many books but I chose the Guernsey Literary and Potato Peel Pie Society which came out quite a few years ago but um, I just love this book. I've read it so many times. Um, it's basically a love story but it's told in letters and in diaries. It's set on the small British island of Guernsey during World War II um, and Guernsey was actually invaded by and occupied by the Nazis and the people of Guernsey had a very, very difficult time of it. Um, this story is so full of warmth and poignancy and sadness and beauty. They made a wonderful movie out of it and um, it's really made me want to go to Guernsey ever since. So, one of my all-time favourite books, The Guernsey Literary and Potato Peel Pie Society. Now, I'm a big reader. Um, I read a lot. Um, I generally try and read every night before I go to bed. Um, it's a really wonderful way of kind of dividing my busy work hours with, um, you know, sliding into sleep. Um, I also like to read on a Sunday morning in bed, um, have a bit of a slower start to the day. Um, and I must admit that I often read um, in cracks in the day as well when I'm not writing. The book uh, that I'm reading at the moment is also set in World War II. Um, I'm just completely fascinated by this period of time. I guess because um, it's still, I think, a great kind of collective psychic wound. Um, it's still in living memory. It's still the greatest, um, you know, example of human evil that we have in our own living memories. And um, most of us know someone, a, a, a grandparent or a parent or a great grandparent who, who lived and suffered during the war. The book I'm reading at the moment is called The Diamond Eye by Kate Quinn. It's literally hot off the presses. I've only just got my greedy hands upon it. Um, Kate Quinn is one of those authors who I will read anything that they write. Um, she just has such a wonderful knack for, compi you know, uh, for combining drama and pathos and humour and um, a really, really swift, powerful pace. If you haven't read any of Kate's books, look, I, I can recommend them all. I've read them all um, and I'm enjoying this one immensely. It's based on a true story of a young woman who became one of the top snipers in World War II. That's what I'm reading now. And while I'm here, um, I'd love you to help me celebrate the launch of my new novel, which is also set in World War II, just one of the most fascinating periods in history. Um, my novel is called The Crimson Thread, and it is set on the Greek island of Crete. Uh, it starts with the German invasion of 1941 and then follows the story of my heroine, Alenka, who hides two Australian soldiers uh, from the Germans at enormous risk to herself and to her family. They have been left behind on the island after the Allied evacuation from Crete. Um, and they have to be hidden in, you know, caves and ruins and, you know, kept out of sight for months and months and months. And there's enormous danger here because Alenka's younger brother is a Nazi um, sympathizer and collaborator and he spies on their every move. It's full of uh, danger and adventure and drama and love. I do hope that you will read it and enjoy it just as much as you love these wonderful books by Kate Quinn and Marianne Schaefer. Happy World Book Day. Bye-bye.